It is now time for playing a classic game. Okay. Here we go. It is now time for playing a classic oh, no. game. I don't want to hear myself a second time. There we go. Cool. Let's do it. One hundred and seventy nine periods remaining until end of world. Uh, I don't remember if we need to do this, so let's do it. So for those of you who don't know, we're going to be going for a mostly blind uh, playthrough, but we are going to be following guides to make sure we get the S rank ending. Or not S rank, but A. The A ending, which is apparently the good end. So we're going to be doing that. So let me go ahead and open that back up. Alright, so we've already done the Nethov Swamp, which means next we have to do the Salerno Academy. Which apparently has kind of a puzzly aspect to it. So that's exciting. Alright, let's do it. Vroom. Nope, that's not right. Vroom. Nope. I'm so fast. I feel like it's down here. Nope, that's not how swamp. There we go. Salerno Academy. We'll do a save state on the way in. Down the vines. Down, down left. Yeah! Hello. We actually don't have any means of healing up outside of combat that doesn't use limited resources, but we can just use magic. And heal a bajillion points to everybody for basically no cost. Um, oh, so close. Oh, he's dead though, so. That's cool. Nice. It's a really useful move to counter with. We're actually gonna. No, we'll I have to go through that. Him, kill him with that, and then we can use all of Walker's actions on the next dude, which is pretty sweet. Definitely don't need to have that happen again. <laughs> and then Walker has three actions that he can just spend going ham on this guy. Boom, boom, boom. Walker does a lot of damage with that three hit move. Like, it's really good, and my guys have super high evasion for some reason. <laughs> Which I'm certainly not going to complain about, but... It 
shall be engraved upon your Your soul. soul. Divine assault. Oh, she's got the more powerful version because she's got multiple actions. It's really cool though how they they were they had the foresight to kind of like portion out the voice clip in such a way that it could be used for either duration uh, attack animation. Like it's actually really smart on their part. I'm kind of impressed by it. Making me want to play Tails games. That's what this game does. Alright. We go left. We're gonna walk in the water. First we're gonna kill this monster. To my side, my noble Einherjar. We have nothing but to fight. Thanks, Lawfer. Alright. Let's throw Firestorm. Have to do a good amount of damage to most of these guys. It'll kill him. I'll make him killable. Wow, so we can just we can one cycle these guys pretty effortlessly with Firestorm. It might not go so well next time. Yeah, but it went fine this time, Lawfer, so stop being a Debbie Downer about it. <laughs> So we're gonna go in here. Now we got some stink on us. Go right up, cut the vines, and walk to the right. Right. Right up, cut the vines, and walk to the right. Down. I couldn't get a first attack on that thing? Side, Weird. Whatever, this is a trivially easy fight. And you're dead. Get out of here. I have drawn average, fortune. average fortune? Why is everybody being so, so fucking grim this time? Like, we do, guys, we're doing fine. We got slanting rain, cool. Oh no, not secret Chivos. It's literally Fire Lance, you're dead. Moving on. I want to note that this dungeon is only available on hard difficulty. Alright, right. Go up. Oops. Whack whack. To my side, my noble Einherjar. Man, this is a really complicated dungeon based on this walkthrough. I'm glad I had it because I never would fucking figure it out on my own. Um, yeah, we'll just do lightning bolt. Oh wow, she got countered on. Offer can kill that one though, and I think Arden Grimm can kill the other one with a three hit. Boop, boop. Oh my god, dude, these fucking monkeys. Get him, Arngrim. Oh, are you serious right now? There we go. Monkeys had a fucking will to live. That was too easy. What's next? Okay. So we go right here to that. We'll first we'll kill this thing. Are you serious? Come on. Whatever, fuck it. I wanna use the vat. Okay, I have strong acid. I go left. I actually need to go kill the monster. Ah! Okay, whatever. To my side, my noble Can't dodge fire. But I can't get first aid on a person who didn't take damage from the fire. He hasn't gone yet, so I'll just fire lance him. Boom, boom, boom. 
and I'm pretty sure that Walfer can just kill the shit out of this guy. Bada bing. It's going very smoothly. I'm sure this will be a really hard boss that's gonna fucking destroy me at the end of this. Alright, left down, right, left. That's what I need to do here. Left. Down. Don't take care of this. To my side, my Okay. This is another easy one. Don't want to do that because we can just have her do Fire Lance on this other thing here. Have her actually manual cast it, which I'm almost certain does more damage. Oh, didn't kill her. Or him, I don't know why I said her. I don't want her to kill her. There we go. Let's get out of here. Alright. Did you think you could defeat me? Go right for an eye of heaven and then go back left. Oh, it's so hard to actually get the preemptive attack to off on the, uh, the figments. Cool, so that one's dead. And then I think Walfer plus Iron Grim can kill the second one. Oh, easy. Well, fucking Lawford can just kill one by himself. And then Iron Grim can kill one by himself with two actions. Alright. I'm very happy about that. I have drawn Chukichi. Good fortune. Okay, I'll take good fortune. Not that it means anything. I have had them. These folks just respawn, or are they just moving around being creepy? Yeah, purify the fuck out of them. Oh yeah, I forgot fire doesn't, or magic doesn't do much damage against these guys. Still did enough to soften them all up so they can all get two hitted. Do an over attack because we can. Let us go, my friends. Okay. Looks like these guys are respawning. I'll kill one more, and then if the number doesn't seem to change, I'm gonna leave. Also, we can experiment with some different magic and see if there's something else that does good damage, like Icicle Edge. Um, uh, that's a little better, but not much. Come on! This is the most hardcore combo guard in human history. This guy really just doesn't want to fucking die. And then he got punched in the face. <laughs> he blocked all the attacks from the fucking, like, goddess of holy warriors, sacred divine sword. And then a dude with a big ass sword fucking punched him in the face one time. I wasn't prepared for that. I wasn't ready for the straight punch, the Chris Redfield special. Let's try Lightning Bolt and see if that does more damage on these guys. Yeah, the only thing that would make this game's combat system a little more fun for me would be if you could switch switch targets mid-combo somehow. Because then you could really do some like very heavily execution-based combos that would let you one-cycle through encounters even faster. Oh, excellent fortune. Cool. Super arbitrary. 